After the winter break, the Champions League is back. Stand by for the drama of knockout football. So we reach the business end of the competition. No second chances, no margin for error. The Sigtas shape up in a 4-5-1. Yeah, it's a formation geared to make life tough for the opposition, though they can't afford their front man to become a bit detached and isolated. on the way so Jim tell me this who are you looking for in particular here well Gareth Bale for me is quite an easy choice here uh, he knows he has the type of acceleration that scares defenders and there's such a directness about his style he doesn't uh, allow many back for a second bite so he can be uh, a devastating presence in this he would be the obvious choice wouldn't he he certainly has all the right qualities a good run down the left-hand side. Bales cross. Shoots! And he's there to make a great save. Well, that was high-class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high-class wage. Sergio Ramos. Cristiano Ronaldo. He's got away. He's had a shot. Missed by a fraction. That's a look and header! Good delivery, no joy. Babo brilliantly anticipated the delivery and he'll be annoyed it didn't lead to more. Ronaldo looking up to see who wants it. It's a promising run he's making on the right. He's going to have to tune his rangefinder before the next one. That's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. Tony Kroos. Isco spreads it towards the left. Now it's Benzema. Chania Erkin goes looking. 
goals as yet. Marcelo. Sergio Ramos. Isco. Good idea, just poorly executed. Now it's Negredo. Nicely controlled. Regardless of the outcome, it is good to see someone running at the defence like that. That the half time whistle goes. So, a fascinating half, full of talking points, not least that last very, very late one. So, there was the first half. The Shiktash ended that first half in such a strong fashion. I think we'll just have to wait and see now if they can rekindle that drive and that determination. It's been great commitment, and that has to be maintained in the second half. Well, after 45 minutes, it is still goalless. A change, perhaps, after half-time. <laughs> Whistle goes, and we start the second half. Nil-nil, then, and we're back on the way. <laughs> Cristiano Ronaldo! That really should have hit the net. Well, I think a little eagerness just got the better of him. He may have been thinking about back-page headlines there. Now the pass. Tried to play it through. Uh, was too timid to make it through the defence. It'll be noted and, and improved upon, I'm sure. Looks like a good ball through. Uh, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Uh, that just required a bit more oomph to reach its target. And it's Oshikup. Fires from distance. Good stop, that wasn't easy. The keeper really dug out his defence then, a magnificent effort. Bale. Good run, where to from here? This goal... Oh, a definite fell there. And he is going into that little black book. Away, the Grado shapes the shoots. And it's Isco. Isco pushes it out wide. Cristiano Ronaldo. It's Cristiano Ronaldo! And he nearly went all the way. I just hope he won't let the failure to score affect him. With the ability he has, he can reproduce. It so nearly came off for him. Yeah, and you can hear how the crowd are reacting to this too. Isco. Tony Kroos plays it forward. Bale looking to get on the end of this. Shoots! World-class Karim Benzema! Finally, the deadlock is broken! Madrid are really pouncing on any stray passes in midfield. We're talking seconds from interception to the back of the net. It's counter-attacking heaven.
Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. Yeah, it's been their hard work that has got him this lead, but I just wonder whether they can keep it up. This may take a toll now. Legredo passes it through. Peter, they have to fight the onset of desperation and keep enough cool heads to still deliver. He's through, now is he in? Well, it remains to be seen whether they can come up with that little bit of class to rescue the situation, and it needs to be any time now, really. And he's searching through. Madrid probably could have killed things off, but they should be OK here. So that's it. It is all over. Well, they've lost the home leg, so life gets a little fraught. All that's left is to win away and somehow keep the dream alive. So what do you take away from it all, Jim? Besiktas can be quite proud of themselves despite the result, and I'm pleased to listen to the applause they're receiving for a, for a gutsy show.